OK, let's talk about addition. Let's do a long addition problem like, I don't know, 251 plus 124. All right, I think that one is straightforward. I think the answer is uh, 375. Am I right? Oh, actually, did you notice what I just did? I went 375. I went left to right. Did you like that? How were you taught to do it? Were you taught to go right to left, perhaps? Well, I think you get the same answer, so does it matter? Now, here's a true part of the story. I remember being very confused by this as a child in school, because I was taught to read left to right in all my classes, except for math class. When it came to doing arithmetic like this, we were told to go right to left, which I thought was strange. So I wonder, why? Well, maybe this example here is too nice. Should I do a more complicated example? Yeah, let's do something like uh, 257 plus 160, I don't know, 4. Is that better? All right, here goes. 2 plus 1 is 3, 5 plus 6 is 11, 7 plus 4 is also 11. 311 to 11. 311 to 11. In fact, I'll even prove that I'm right. I'll draw you a picture. Here goes. So this is a 10-1 machine. Maybe I should write that, because society's going to be 10-1 here. 257. I literally say two hundreds. Yep. 50, five tens, and seven. There they are. And we're being asked to add to that 164. OK, add on one more hundred. I can do that. Add on six more tens. No worries. I can do that. Add on, add on four more ones. Piece of cake. So the question is, how many hundreds do I have? Three. How many tens do I have? Uh, I have 11 of them. How many ones do I have? I have 11 of them. I was right. 311 to 11. In fact, I even said it correctly. 311 T, T-Y, 11. This answer here is actually correct. It's mathematically solid. There is nothing mathematically wrong with this answer. Though I do believe that people think I'm strange when I say 311 T, 11. OK, the issue is not the mathematics. Math is fine with this answer. It's society that doesn't like this. They want me to do something with this answer. So what do they want me to do? Well, they don't like me saying 11 T. So what can I do here? Well. I could do some explosions to fix this, up, fix this up for society. In fact, I could do an explosion here, or I could do an explosion there. Now, most people probably want me to go right to left. I don't know why, so I'll do this one here instead. Let's explode 10 dots from here and see if we can fix up this 11 a little bit. All right, 10 dots explode to become one. Kapow! I guess that leaves one dot behind. There it is. It makes an extra dot there. 401 to 11. Absolutely correct. Nothing wrong with that. Oh, I do speak strangely there. 400, 1T, 11. All right, another explosion. Here goes, 10 from here, kapow! I guess that leaves, what, one dot behind? Extra dot there. 421. That's correct. That's the answer society likes, though they might say 20 rather than 2T. That's OK. Now it's a style thing. So there we go. I actually do like going left to right and doing my explosions as I go along. So I now wonder, what were you taught to do and is what you were taught to do the same as what I did, really? Are we just doing a different style of approach to mathematics here? I kind of liked it. I liked 311 to 11. It's a good answer. But I also understand society likes 421 too. It's all good. All correct math leads to good places in the end. Wonderful.